example using right triangle tray. A swimming pool is 20 meters in length and 12 meters wide. The bottom of the pool is slanted so that the water depth is 1.3 meters. Find or at the shallow end and 4 meters at the deep end. Find the angle of depression of the bottom of the pool. So what I've done is I've drawn a picture for you. So here is your length of your pool, 20 meters. This would be your shallow end of 1.3 meters. This would be your deep end of a total of 4 meters. What I did is I took the distance from 4 meters minus 1.3 to get this 2.7. And I created two separate pictures. This is a picture of a rectangle, and then this is a picture of a triangle. And we want to find out what is the angle of depression from this bottom point. So we're going to use trigonometry. So I'm going to label this side opposite and this side adjacent to my angle A. And I want to choose the appropriate trig function that works with opposite and adjacent. And that is tangent. So I say the tangent of any angle is found by taking opposite over adjacent. And now I plug in what I know. Tangent of A equals opposite 2.7 divided by adjacent 20. Now to solve for this angle, I have to use inverse trig. I say A equals the tangent inverse of 2.7 divided by 20. Make sure your calculator is in degree mode. Now you're going to go second tan. Again, shift or second tan. However your calculator is. My graphing calculator is second tangent. And then you put your fraction in 2.7 divided by 20. And what you get is your angle measure of 7.68 degrees is the angle of depression, the slope, the slant of your um, pool.